Welcome back to our children ministry service and welcome to all those online. So everyone here, same thing like how we always do every week. We want to say hello to them, okay? So the camera is going to move around and we're going to say hello to you. Okay, ready? Why don't you everyone say hello to the camera? Okay, look, yeah, hello, hello, yeah. Okay, and the other side, hello. Wonderful, it's going to be an amazing, amazing day because today, what is what kind of celebration are we having today? Who knows? Who knows? Hands up, hands up. Yes. Christmas celebration. Exactly. We're going to have our Christmas celebration. And today the theme is the gift, which means all of you might be receiving a lot of nice gifts today. Huh. So it's going to be a fun, fun day. So before we start, okay, I'm going to count to three and then we're going to off the lights. So we're going to have that feel. Okay, so and all of you as well, you pretend that your lights is being off. Okay, we're going to count to three. One, two, three. Boom. Oh, it's going to start to turn off because, oh, the lights is a bit, let me say again, one, two, can we turn off the house lights please, okay? So that all of us will be ready to receive our friends, okay? I'm going to have two friends on stage and they are going to come up, okay? So everyone, I want all of you to give a big clap as I say, we're going to welcome our friends, ready? One, two, three, big, a big clap, yeah, let's welcome all of our friends on stage, yay! <laughs> Hi everybody! Good morning! Hello! Hi everyone! Welcome, Welcome to church! Welcome everybody to church. say hi! Hi! So good to see all of you today! Yeah. Welcome to you online! Welcome! You are joining us. Hello! Now, it's so good to see you! It's so good to see you too! Hey. I, that's right! You know we haven't seen each other in so long! Yeah, we haven't seen you, you, you! All of you as well! Welcome to all of you who join us online. Hello. Now, so all of you that are here online and also physical. So we're going to have a wonderful time today, right? Of course, but I think we need to tell them who we are. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, yeah, you, you, see, you know see, who see, we you are? You always forget. You always forget. Yeah, I forgot. Mm. Okay, but, but, but do you know who I am? You, oh, maybe you all don't know. Do you yeah, know maybe. who we are? Who, do you know who we are? No, no. Oh. no I, I heard, I, I heard ah, yes, yes, I heard yes. yes, some of you know us, yes. Who so. is this, who is this? <laughs> Dr. Tickle, yes, yes. Dr. Tickle. Hello, hello, my name is Dr. Tickle. Yes. Do you know who this is? I know you guys kids are not too sure, right? But it's okay, we'll learn. You are right, this is Professor Nemo, yeah. yes! You, okay, so how do you remember us is that I'm a doctor, so you see I have this. But she is Professor Nemo and Nemo is orange in colour, so you see? Right, right? That is how you remember us, okay? Alright, so Dr. Tickle, I think we want to welcome somebody special in the house. Oh, 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 who yeah, are? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, how many of you here is First time joining us here. Raise your hand. Your first time ever in church, in, in physical church here. Raise your hand. Can I see hands? Ah, really? okay. You yeah, are first time, you first time in church in SIBKL. You will get a gift. Oh, yeah, ah, that's right. You'll get a gift. Yeah, well, so the Coco Cheche will go to you and get, a, get you a yeah, gift. Yeah, so keep your hands raised, keep your hands up. Yep, we yep, will yep, give yep. you a little gift, okay? Just keep your hands up, alright? If you haven't gotten it. Alright! Wow, very Thank good. Thank you! Now, I think we are gonna have a very exciting day today. It is the best time of children ministry, which is lesson time! But today is extra special because we have a special guest. I'm gonna invite Cheche Amy. Cheche Amy? Can we find her? Where is she? Cheche Amy. Let's call her. I think she's actually a bit shy one. Let's call her again. Can we call her? Cheche Amy. Where are you? Is she hiding? Wait lah. Cheche Amy, where are you? Already. Is she hiding there? Did you see her? No? Is she up there? No? Oh, there she is. Hi. Oops, 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 oops. Careful. Everybody say hi. Hi everyone! Hello! Hi! Hi children! Hi everyone! Wow! 
know Christmas is coming and it's just a few days away. Are you excited to celebrate with your family and friends? If you're excited, say yes. Okay, let me hear from this side. Children, if you're excited, say yes. Okay, let me hear from this side. Children, if you're excited, say yes. Wow. And how about those watching online? If you're excited, say yes. Wow, I can hear you loud and clear. Now, what do you love about Christmas? Ah, oh, uh -huh, I know. Is it because of the gift? Show me your hand if you love Christmas because of the gift. Wow, I can see lots of hands here. And I can see your hands including those watching online. Okay, well look children, we have so many gifts on the stage. I'm very sure you have received gifts during your birthday time or when you did well at schools or even at home. Okay, children, today I bring my special gifts and I'm sure you're wondering what's inside. Okay, today we are going to learn about the greatest gift that God gives us. Now everybody says God's greatest gift. And it is taken from the B-I-B-L-E And everybody says Bible Are you ready for Bible story? If you are ready What I need you to do is Pay attention One day There was this young girl Named Mary And she was engaged To a good man named Joseph they live in a town called Nazareth. And one day, an angel came to visit Mary. Mary was so surprised and scared. <gasps> Who are you? Why are you here? The angel said, Don't be afraid. I am the angel. And I've come to bring the good news. You have found favor in God. And God has chosen you to carry a baby. But... Mary said, you mean me? How can I have a baby? I'm not married. But the angel said, it's okay, Mary. This baby is going to be God's son and you will name him Jesus. So Mary went and told Joseph about the angel's visit. Joseph was confused and scared. But Joseph loves Mary very much and he wants to protect her from the people. And one night, an angel appeared to Joseph in a dream while he was sleeping. <coughs> Joseph, don't be afraid. God has a great and wonderful plan for you and Mary. Mary is going to have God's son and he is going to be the savior of all mankind. Give him the name Jesus and remember, take good care of Mary and the baby when he comes. So Joseph woke up from the dream and he did what the angel told him to do. Joseph took Mary as his wife. Not long after that, the ruler ordered the people to return to their hometown to register their name. So, Mary followed Joseph back to his hometown called Bethlehem. So children, do you know where is Joseph's hometown? Where is it? Yes, you're right, it's Bethlehem. While she was pregnant, they traveled back to Bethlehem. During that time, Joseph and Mary, they don't travel using planes, cars, or even Clean. They ride on donkeys and sometimes they walk. Children, do you know how long it took for them to reach Bethlehem? Wow, you know the answers. Four to five days. That's very long, right? And it is so tiring, especially when Mary was pregnant. The tummy was big and heavy and she has to walk very slowly. And by the time they reach Bethlehem, they want to find a place to rest. But there were no rooms, and all rooms are fully booked. Oh no, 
Then where is Joseph and Mary going to stay? Well, they finally found a place to stay. And children, do you know where they stay? Wow, everybody, you all know the answer. It is a place called stable. Okay, a place where the animals sleep and eat. And you know what, children? It's yucky and it's smelly and dark there with lots of animals. And children, do you think you want to sleep in a stable? Huh? <laughs> I don't want. It's very dark there. Teacher don't want to sleep there. <laughs> you want? Teacher don't want. <laughs> but Joseph and Mary, they didn't complain. And after they rested there, something happened. Children, what happened? Let's find out. Wow! Everybody say wow! Wow! Yes, children, it's baby Jesus. Baby Jesus was born. And Mary gave birth to a baby boy named Jesus. And everyone says Jesus. And wow, look children, we have a gift. And this is God's greatest gift. And Joseph and Mary were very happy about their newborn son. <sighs> but then no one knows about baby Jesus. And this is God's greatest gift, but no one knows about Jesus. And you know what happened children? On that night, there were shepherds out in the field and they were looking after their sheep. And children, what, how does the sheep sound like? Ah, okay. And they were enjoying the night skies and they were looking at the moon and the stars. And suddenly there is a great sound, melodies coming from the sky. Ah, children look up. There are somebody singing there, so special. I wonder what is that sound? Let's open the next box and find out who are they? What do you think children? I can't hear you. Wow! Yes, everybody got it right. It was the angel that sang glory to God in the highest and on earth peace, good will toward man. Wow! The angel's singing was so glorious. And the angel was so bright. And the shepherds covered their face with their hand. And the angel told them about the birth of baby Jesus and how would they find them. And the shepherds jumped with joy. Because you know why? It was their first time meeting baby Jesus. And so they packed their stuff and they walked and they traveled to, to find this baby Jesus. And when they finally found this baby Jesus sleeping in a manger, wrapped in a clothes, and they bow down and worship baby Jesus because he is the son of God. And they are so happy and they told everyone they met about baby Jesus. Then children, in a far and a far, far land, there were a group of people watching the stars. And you know what, you know what children, on that day when Jesus was born, there was this biggest, brightest, and beautiful stars in the sky. And guess what? The wise men saw the star and they followed the star until they arrived to a place table where Jesus was born. And they brought gifts with them. And children, what gifts do you think the wise men brought for baby Jesus? Do you think, huh? I heard Santa Claus? No. Do you think it's toy car? And do you think it's milk bottle because baby Jesus need to drink milk? Or was it baby clothes? What do you think? I don't think so. What is that? Ah, the wise man brought Jesus the very best gift they could find. And what was it? Ah. Wow, children. What's in the basket? You want to know? Ah, it is gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Wow. Children, repeat after me. Gold. 
Wah, wow, this is frankincense. Huh. And lastly, this is myrrh. Ah. All these three gifts were expensive and very difficult to get. And they present the gifts to baby Jesus. And they bow down and they worship baby Jesus. And because they knew that Jesus is the Savior and the Son of God. So children, which gift is the best? Was it the gold, frankincense, or myrrh? Or was it baby Jesus? I can't hear you. Ah. Yes, it's baby Jesus. And Jesus is God's gift to us, the greatest gift ever. And that's what Christmas is all about. Children, I want you to remember these three points. Number one, we learned that Jesus is the Son of God. And number two, we also learned that Jesus is God's greatest gift to us. And number three, tell others about Jesus. Okay, now children, let's repeat after me. Number one. Jesus is the Son of God. And number two, Jesus is God's greatest gift to us. And number three, tell others about Jesus. Great children, I hope you are blessed by the story. Today the memory verse is taken from John 3, 16a. For God so loved the world that He gave His only Son. Okay children, let's say this together. One, two, three. John 3, 16a. For God so loved the world that He gave His only Son. Okay, children, let's hear from the girls and those who are online. Girls, let's do this together. One, two, three. John, three, sixteen, A. For God so loved the world that He gave His only Son. Okay, now let's hear from the boys. Boys, you can do louder than girls, right? Okay, ready? One, two, three. John. 316A For God so loved the world That He gave His only Son Wow, children, everybody, let's say it one more time One, two, three John 316A For God so loved the world That He gave His one and only Son Great job, children Hey, Auntie Julia? Yes, yes, yes. Why are you here? Oh, actually, children, I'm looking for a very special gift that I made. But I can't seem to find it. Julia Amy, can you help me find it? Mm, yeah. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Do you think it's under the table? I don't know. Shall we move the table? Okay. Let's see if it's underneath the table. Uh, eh? Oh, oh. Not here, oh. Not here, oh. Hmm. Ah, maybe it's, it be? maybe it's at the back. Ah, you help me find? Yeah, sure. Okay, well, Jujie and Amy, help me find the bag. Children, can you all help me find where's this special gift that I made? Okay, what special gift? Let me see. I'll give you a hint. Uh, 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 it's a uh, um, uh, gold color box. And then it has... Oh, 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 okay, okay. Oh, 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 where, 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 where? Wait, wait, I haven't finished giving you the hint yet. Whoa! We, 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 we... With green ribbon. Ah, uh, and then, and then, and then with, uh, 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 ah, yeah, 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 with red thing on top. Ah, this one, ah! Eh, no, leh. Not this one, oh. Which one, leh? Auntie Julia blind already. Yes, I found it, I found it, I found it. <gasps> I finally found you. Wow. Ah, he knows, right, right, right. Yes, I found it, I found it. Wow, you know, I've been thinking so, so hard. What to, um, what to uh, give uh, God a gift? Ah, do you know, oh sorry, do you know that who this gift is for? 
or I just give away the answer. Ayya, Auntie Julia shouldn't do that. That's right. I made this special gift for God. That's why this is extra, 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 extra special. Children, can you tell me what gift can we give to God? Hmm. Hmm. Food, ah, hear food, oh. Worship, wow, all good answers, superb answers. What can we give to the king that has everything? You all want to know what's inside? You all want to know? Let's see what I prepared. <coughs> oh, I hear remote control. give God my heart I want to give God a heart that is open wide a heart that is got nothing to hide you know sometimes I made mistake uh, so my heart not so clean one then very dark also uh, because I got anger la. Uh, sometimes I go and break my chiche koko toy la. you know got a lot of things so my heart not very very good but I still want to give God my heart that has nothing to hide yeah you know a heart that has nothing to hide because more than anything I could do for God or more than anything that I can sacrifice because God wants my heart but you know when I give God my heart right His blood can wash my heart clean and then it become <gasps> go that's why Jesus is our precious gift. Yeah. See, God loves us so much and we are as precious as gold to Him. Can you say to yourself, say, I'm very precious to God. My heart is very precious to God. You see, when God loves us so much and we are so precious to Him, this is truly what Christmas is all about. He gave us His greatest gift. Children say, what is God's greatest gift to us? Which is? Jesus! That's right! So now, this Christmas, what will you want to give God this Christmas? Will you give your heart to Jesus? Okay, I'm going to put this back. Okay, I'm going to ask everyone, if you would like to give your heart to Jesus, would you now just close your eyes so that nobody watching you? Yeah, just close your eyes and then answer Auntie Julia. Would you want to give your heart to Jesus? If your answer is yes, I want you to put up your hands. I want you to put up your hands. Yeah, just keep your eyes closed so nobody watching you. You're not distracted to see whether the Coco Chiche Auntie Uncle is looking at you. Just close your eyes and put up your hands if you want to accept. You want to invite God to be in your heart. Yeah, and I want all the buddies to just lay your hands on them for the children who lift up their hands. And I want you to follow Auntie Julia in this prayer. Some of you are a bit shy, maybe um, children at home watching. If you want Jesus to be in your heart and you want to give Jesus this heart of yours, I want you to say this prayer together. Okay. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I'm a sinner. And I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died for my sin and rose again from the dead. Forgive my sin and I invite you to come into my heart 